Oh my God, guys, I think it's here. I think, oh, it is here. It is here, bro, it's here. I'm not even gonna tell you what it is. I'm not gonna tell you what it is right here. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so excited. I have a complaint about this. I see, I'm gonna pick this up and take it inside and we're gonna show you what's in here. But I have a complaint first. Something really bad happened with this and I'm, I'm not upset about it. I don't get upset about stuff, but seriously, this is ridiculous. All right, guys, obviously I can't hide what this is. It says right there on the box. But what's interesting is where I got it from. I got these fish from Amazon. Yes, they sell live fish on Amazon, and I think this has been going on for a while now. So if you haven't gotten in on this, you need to do it. You can literally sit on your couch and do nothing and order fish or bait, order your new friend, whatever you want. It comes in a box to your door. They guarantee live arrival. Some of it is relatively expensive. Most of it is relatively expensive. But here's where the problem comes in. Amazon does not ship the fish. Everybody knows Amazon has giant warehouses. They don't have live animals there. So the companies that sell the fish use their own carrier to ship the fish. Take a look right here, FedEx, FedEx. Okay guys, FedEx has charged me money for overnight shipping in the past and not giving me overnight shipping. And I'm talking about, I ordered an iPhone from um, Apple and they used FedEx to ship it. And it, I paid $45 for overnight shipping and it took a week. <laughs> because FedEx passed my house, said the item couldn't be delivered, and came back a week later, just because they felt like it, after I paid $45 for shipping, when I could have just got free shipping that already takes a week. So I didn't purposely order this from FedEx. I ordered it from Amazon. The company sent it through FedEx, and very obviously, it's live animals. This is not an iPhone. This can't stay in the Florida heat in delivery trucks for a week. So what happened was I ordered it. It said on my email from this company that it would be here in one day after they shipped it. Um, there was varying like delivery times because Amazon didn't know because it was coming through FedEx, but the company told me it'll be here in one day. So I was expecting it to be here. I was expecting it to come home from work and unload the fish so they didn't die. Um, and it's been now three days since I ordered the fish, since they were shipped, sorry, since they left the facility where they were raised. Um, so <laughs> we're hoping that <laughs> they actually are alive, right? So they, they're, they guarantee that the fish will arrive alive, okay? So if there's a problem with that, I can always contact the company or Amazon or both. Um, if you're wondering how much something like this costs, this is 100 um, small goldfish. 100 small goldfish right here. Um, it was $85 off Amazon. You could probably go to the pet store closest to you and get them for like $12. But shipping and everything, and they didn't charge you separately for anything. It was all it was $85 and the shipping was free, but it was included. So enough of my talking. We have to open up the live fish and hope that they are alive. The packaging right here, that is worry, that's worrisome. This FedEx freaking guys. I would not recommend ordering anything through FedEx at all, ever. But sometimes you can't help it, you don't know who's gonna ship them. All right. So they come in this cool styrofoam thing, I guess. And... Here's the bag. Oh, can you see them? Yeah. Can you see them on that side? Do you mean to turn around? No, I can see them all. They're alive. They're alive. I can see them all. I don't see any dead ones from where I'm at. No, me either. They're all breathing. Look at these. They come in like, I'm trying to make sure y'all can see them. They come in different colors, obviously, and they got calico, they got like platinum. They got some that are just straight up orange. These are almost like little koi fish. They're cool looking. There might be like... The water looks pretty dirty 
and I definitely have seen at least one dead so far, at least one. But there's supposed to be a hundred, and some of them aren't like moving or anything, which is, you know. <laughs> so, you some tell. of them, but you, if you poke them, they move. So, yeah. they, it looks like almost all of them are alive, which is great. So, we're going to go ahead and put them in their aquarium, um, the bag itself, and acclimate them. And then we're going to let them go into the aquarium. I'm not going to show you guys the full aquarium yet because it is kind of in progress and it's a little bit dirty and the light's not on or anything. But we're going to go ahead and set all our little guys in there. Just go ahead and let it float. Okay. And then we're going to let them float here and acclimate for probably about 20 minutes. And then we will come back. All right, guys, so they're done acclimating, so we're going to go ahead and slice the bag open. It's whoa, very whoa. thick. Yeah! Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's two bags. And they're both very thick. Would you look at that? The water. Wow, look at all those fish. Wow, look at all those, Ray Ray. All right, so the water they're in is super dirty, so I'm going to go ahead and get them out of this water. Okay. Okay. Let's go in the bucket. Yep, and now. in the bucket. You ready? Yeah. That's ugly. Oh, yeah. Good boy. Okay. Look at all those. Look at all those guys. That's crazy, isn't it? Okay, we're going to go ahead and put them in the tank. We got to hurry. They can't breathe. Okay. Y'all ready? Come get, get closer. Sir. Look at them all, guys. Look, wow. It's more fish. Wow. One of them's stuck. One of them's stuck. Uh oh. His fin is stuck. Wow. Uh oh. Is that one alive? What? <laughs> Sarah, check him. Give him CPR. Oh. Is he? Is he? Oh. 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 There he goes. Yeah. Guys, look at all those. Are any of them dead? They all went to the bottom. Oh. oh Stop. I think I see a few deads. No, I don't know. I said go to bed. No, they're all they're all breathing. Look at all these guys. They have Yeah, they have all different colors. Um We got yeah, I mean even the ones that are upside down are breathing though. So I mean they have been in the mail for 3 days. So I guess we'll see what happens here. I think it's just that Yeah, well, that, that one there is not looking so hot the orange one. But we have like we have like calico, we have like platinum, we have straight orange. We have some that are white and orange, um, like just a tiny bit of orange. And some of them have kind of fancy little fins. I don't know, they're pretty cool. That one right there is cool. Let's see which other one is pretty cool. This one I like. I don't know, I like that one. Um, I wonder if any of them are albino. They have like red eyes. That one's cool right there. One fish. How many fish you think there is? Uh, two. Two fish? Yeah, that's pretty close. All right, guys, here's the final product. These fish were in the mail for three days in a plastic bag, but there's over 100 in this tank right now and they're all alive and well. Their colors are nice, their fins are nice. They're all breathing and kicking. Some of them are looking for food already, which is insane considering they just came out of the, the freaking box. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave this company a five-star review on Amazon and on their website. That is absolutely ridiculous, unbelievable that they all survived the shipment over a hundred fish arrived. I got more than what I paid for. One fish did not make it. That is crazy. I was expecting the worst, honestly, when I saw that the um, the package got delayed. It was on its way from Missouri and it got delayed in Tennessee and then it got delayed in Tampa um, and, it, and then it was out for delivery and it got delivered while I was gone today. So even longer, I mean, it probably got delivered in the morning and I'm here in the evening. Um, so it absolutely crazy all of the fish are awesome um i like the way the tank turned out this tank is an old one um that's why it looks kind of crusty you can tell it's age um it's probably made in the 70s i think but um i'm really happy with the way it turned out 
this is awesome. Um, let me know what you guys think we should order next. What live animals should we get from Amazon next? There's gotta be something crazy. Look it up on Amazon, drop it in the comments, let me know, and we will do it. I'll see you guys in the next one.